I guess we're going back to part three where we're doing the last set of cards. Due to the number of repeats on the others, all I'm going to do is show you the GX cards and anything that turns up we've not seen before, just to make this last video quicker for you, and then we'll go through the GX cards at the end. So we're on the last pack of all the GX cards from this run, so we'll do this last one in full. As you can see, same cards you've already looked at in the first two parts of this video. And the final GX. So, GX is in this pile. So these cards feel a lot different to the other ones. The standard style Pokemon cards feel really plasticky, not very nice. So these are GX cards from the third stack we had. Um, so what we'll quickly do is run you through the other GX cards we had. There are a few repeats, but it's worth bearing in mind, especially if you missed the first part. So we'll have a look now. So here's the rest of the GX cards as promised. What I have found with this box set is, compared to some of the ones I've reviewed, it's been awful. Uh, the main draw for me was the possibility of the team up cards. Not many of them in here, all standard GX as I've seen in other box sets, um, especially if you're collecting these fakes. So, I wouldn't recommend this one. It's stuff you can get in other box sets, a bit more sort of specific to what you want. But that was our Unbroken Bonds fake box off eBay. So, till next time guys, stay safe, keep gaming.